So here we are with the little Honda CRV. Uh, we just put the cylinder head in because it had this little bad valve. And it's the next morning. We're going to do a cold start, see how it does. Let's see. That starter sounds pretty sick. But the engine sounds really good. A starter, the Bendix isn't disengaging. We had nothing to do with that. It didn't make that noise yesterday. Way to go, starter. Way to ruin my cold start video. Son of a monkey's uncle. Let's hear that again. See, it sounds good now. Stupid starter. Oh well. There's your legitimate cold start. You know I'm not faking nothing. <laughs> Look at the burn on that thing. The thing looks like it just got old and cracked up and oxidized. I guess if the valves don't close all the way, you get the fire going through there and instead of being one flat good surface, um, you know, that can take the heat, it gets all along this little rim and then being along the rim and everything, it, you know, heat it up real quick. Maybe I'll do a demo with the torch and show you what I'm talking about. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to burn up this nail and show how where metal's thin, it burns up easier, like it did on this valve versus where it's thick. It can dissipate heat. So, hit the gas. Spark it. on the nail it takes a little while you go to that tip and that tip's going to heat up right now and just go away heat the nail no big deal heat the tip where it's thin and you can just rock it so that's the principle that i was talking about i don't know how well that showed up on camera but that gives you an idea Wherever you have a lot of exposed surface area or the metal's thin, it'll just get rocked. But if it's thick, it'll hang in there pretty good and just kind of shed the heat up to a certain point. It just basically it doesn't take very long if something's thin, whether it's sheet metal or if it's pointy or it has an edge for it to uh, uh, heat up and to oxidize real fast. I don't know how many other ways to say it. That's why I try to show it. Pictures worth a thousand words, a video's worth a million.